Yeah, welcome to Spencer's Academy, where we are devoted to helping students to be more advanced in their calculation skill. Like I always say, if you think you can solve this question on the board, don't hesitate to solve it. Make sure to put your answer in the comment section below. Don't worry even if you don't have the answer, because I'm going to show you a simple trick that you can use to solve questions like this. Now let's get to it. The question says, given 3s squared plus s equal to 1, find the value of 6x to the power 3 minus s to the power 2 minus 3s plus 20, 20. So what we're going to do is we're going to see solution first and uh, write what is given to us. What is given to us is 3s squared plus s equal to 1. You know, the first step is to move this s to the right hand side. You know, when I move the s to the right hand side, s is going to be negative, so it becomes negative x. Now, because I'm seeing this s cube here, I'm going to multiply this 3s squared by a value that will give me this s cube. And what is that? If I multiply this by 2s, it's going to give me 6s cubed. So let me do that. So 2s multiplied by 3s squared. Are you seeing that? And remember, whatever I do to the left, I must also do to the right. So let's do that to the right as well. By using 2s to multiply 1 minus x. That's it. So let's multiply. So 2s times 3s squared will give you 6s cubed. Are you seeing that? Equal to, now 2s times 1 will give you 2x. Minus 2s times s will give you 2x squared. Now, I'm going to have to call this one equation 1. You know why? Because I'm going to put this 6s cubed into what the question asks us to find. So let's do that. Whenever I see six s cubed, I'll have to put 2s minus 2s squared because that's the value of six s cubed. So this is what I have here, six s cubed. In place of this, I'm going to have to put this. So let's do that. So 2x minus 2s squared. So that has taken the place of six s cubed. Now put minus s squared minus 3s then plus 20 20. now check out for like terms now i have a uh, minus 2s square minus s square this is going to give me minus 3s square right good now what about this 2s minus 3s it's going to give me minus s now write your plus 20 20. See how simple this is? Now notice something. That something is common here. Please don't touch the x. I don't need any algebra out. I just need a sign. Now I have negative common here. So you have to factorize the negative out. So let me bring out the negative. Now what is going to remain here? I'll be having 3s squared. Now since negative is out, automatically here becomes positive. Now write your x. Now I have plus 20, 20. Now notice this item. And notice what the question said. That given 3s squared plus s is equal to 1. Look at this. 3s squared plus s. The question says it is taken as what? 1. That means whenever I see 3s squared plus s, I'm going to have to write 1. And this is what I have here. So I'm going to have to write 1 here. So minus the whole of this item is now 1 plus 20, 20. And what do you think is the answer? Minus 1 plus 20, 20 is going to have to give you 20, 19 as the answer. Now look at what we have. Is there 20, 19 on the board? Yes, this is it. Very simple. I tell you, whenever you are given a question like this, 
and you follow this same method and pattern, you're going to have to have the answer no matter what. You will always have the answer. You will never be wrong. Just try it out in case you find another question like this. And if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't. Turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss whenever I drop a new video. Go ahead and put comments if you know you really enjoy this. Even if you have doubt, put it on the question, on the comment section. I'm going to answer your question there. And until next time, take care.